this is Praxis, and today we're doing a product review of these polycarbonate panels that we bought for our uh, greenhouse roof. And uh, this is an unboxing. Uh, we've all seen YouTube videos where it's uh, supposed to be a product review, and they're literally opening up the box and couldn't possibly know anything other than, ooh, look at the packaging or whatever. So yeah, we don't know anything about these. Uh, they've been completely covered up. Uh, they are, what are they, 20, uh, 25 millimeters, I think? Uh, 25. Yeah, the 25. Inch. Yeah, the 25 millimeter pa uh, panels, and they have all these little um, multiple walls. Yeah, multiple walls. You should be doing this. I said no words in my mouth. Uh, they have these multiple walls. So if you got the outside air that's cold in the winter, and then your indoor air, they've got these multiple layers. It's kind of like a triple pane window, except these have 11 walls in them. Uh, so I, I, I'm not sure. Are all the 11 walls? No, it's not in thickness, it's in, yeah. in separation. Yeah, yeah, in separation. Though. But I mean, there are a lot of little chambers in there. So uh, in the past, I uh, have had a greenhouse at my other place. Uh, uh, in that one, I had uh, some fiberglass on the bottom, and then I ran some greenhouse plastic roofing material that people will just, like it's on a roll, that uh, uh, people will roll over those kind of round greenhouses you see. I took that, I put a layer of that, and then on top of that, to protect that from the elements, I put some corrugated plastic roofing. So I guess that would be kind of a triple pane window that I did. And again, this is 11 panes in here. Here's kind of like a double pane. These are, they just gave us these as like the packing, oh, I went. I really didn't want to take that off. I'm going to do it anyway for you guys. Take the hit. Um, they, they just use this as packing material. And this is some of the corrugated stuff. So if you imagine this is kind of double pane, ours has all these tiny little uh, layers within it. And it's much, much thicker. So it should w work really well. Now what we're going to be doing today is getting everything kind of lined up and square because, you know, the idea is, is this uh, greenhouse roof is a perfect rectangle down to the millimeter, uh, but the reality is I'm sure that's not the case. Uh, for instance, we know that the uh, wall of the house around the windows, it bows out a little bit. How much do you think of that wall bows out? Uh, three quarters. Yeah, yeah. So uh, not, not a lot, but, uh, you know, it's something. So what we're going to be doing today is getting nice straight lines up there, create a drawn actual rectangle. Ooh, there's the product reveal. There you go. And you can see the thickness of the panels. Right here, it's just about an inch or so. Uh, so, uh, wow, let's, we have to take off all those sheets on the top. Um, these also have uh, double layers of UV protection on them as well, uh, and it's guaranteed for 10 years, which kind of sounds like a lot, but I don't want to replace my roof every 10 years. I don't know. Doesn't that seem like not that much for a roof? No. Yeah. Let's hope it lasts a lot longer than Yeah, <laughs> that's uh, almost a guarantee it for. So that's what we're doing today. When I got here this morning, as you can see, I did more of the wall boards uh, in here. That's going really fast. I'm making really efficient use of the wood. The longest piece of scrap is just a few inches because I'm kind of jockeying back and forth between the two sides. Uh, and it's just, it's really going well. So uh, yeah. as soon as we can put up the last couple pieces of trim, uh, we're going to start uh, getting this stuff ready. And that's great. Now we just need the wind to blow and start yeah, gussing away. That's it. Thanks for watching.